Hi, I'm Dan Coffin. Once again, we're out in the pumpkin patch looking at problems that are trying to get a hold of these pumpkins. And we found a few more. As I was walking by, I saw this low spot in the field. The leaves were lower than average. They were off color. And as I look at the leaves on the plant, you pull them off and you'll start to see you've got a bright yellow leaf here and that's not normal for a pumpkin. Brown blotches and spotches and all kinds of brown dots all around the outside of this leaf. That disease is called anthracnose. Now be careful, it's not anthrax, that's a severe problem. Anthracnose. And anthracnose basically is a disease that likes warm, wet weather. The spores of anthracnose will bounce off the soil and get into the crop. And as the rain splashes on the leaf, it will continue to spread the, the spores or the little eggs of the fungus around the canopy and the leaves start to die. And again, like any other problem on, on pumpkins or melons or squash or cucumbers, once the canopy starts to die and the shading is gone, there's no more way to make sugars for the, for the plant or the fruit and no way to cover them and keep them protected from the sunlight. So as you have anthracnose killing the plants early in the season, you may see the pumpkins try to, to ripen, but they won't be mature. And then oftentimes when you move them into storage, you'll start to see little uh, quarter to half inch size circles, dark brown circles, they may be up to an inch, inch around. And there may be bunches of them all over the surface of that fruit. If that's the case, you've had anthracnose on those pumpkins during the season. And once the uh, blotches start to show on the pumpkin, it'll rot pretty quickly. So be aware of that. Can you control anthracnose? Yes, you can. We have a product at Garden Vigor called Emerald Mist. Emerald Mist has a beautiful bright blue color. You'll notice it when you see it in the web on the website. Mix Emerald Mist about four ounces per gallon of water and spray it on a five to seven day interval throughout the season. You can keep that plant healthy and free from diseases like anthracnose and the mildews all through the season if you spray it. If you miss a spray or two and you start seeing anthracnose show up, get back into that rotation very quickly and move the interval up to about every three days to try to keep the plant healthier until you kind of get that um, uh, anthracnose in check. It will still try to spread on you, but as long as you're spreading the material, it should be very helpful to keep that plant growing and keep it healthy. So if you have questions about anthracnose, or growing pumpkins or cucurbits, the crops that we have with melons, pumpkins, squash, cucumbers, any of those crops. If you have questions, you get a hold of us at www.gardenvigor.com and we'll do our level best to get you the answers.